Hey, so I know I haven't been very consistent with my vlogs lately, and by, I mean, I have been consistent about not putting them up. But I've, I've been trying to film a lot lately, they just haven't been working. Um, another problem is that my parents, if, I can't do it anytime they're in the house, because I do love to say the fuck word. Fuck, 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 fuck you, I'm gonna kick your ass. Uh, so, hopefully this will work, fingers crossed. Um... Bloodlines. Uh, very good episode. I'm excited because the season's taking a turn for the good. Um, admittedly, I did not hate Invasion as much as everyone else because, honestly, I'm cool with them, you know, doing bad things to the characters or taking some characters out because that happens in other shows too, guys. Young Justice is not special. It does not have to follow your every whim. It just doesn't have to do that. But, admittedly, it was... It was falling down, but it's getting very, very good now. Um, so there, were, there were two plots. Um, one was the Bart Allen coming from the future, being impulse, being awesome. Sh me shipping him with Beast Boy, so, 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 so hard. Um, and then uh, Cheshire and Roy finding Speedy. So let's start with Cheshire and Speedy. Um, See, there really wasn't much with that. Um, there was a lot of badass fighting. Um, <laughs> I think that was, like, the funniest thing I've ever seen, where it was like, should I be disturbed by our baby's obvious, like, like by our child's, like, obvious love for violence? I'm not sure what the exact line was, but I thought that was hilarious. And then they found Speedy, and, and, and then that happened, and his arm was cut off, like we knew. But, yeah, that, that happened. Um, also... With the poem Bart Allen plotline. There's a lot to talk about. I mean, not really a lot to talk about. Let's just see how much. I don't know what's going on. I'm rambling. I'm hyper. Um, I just got back from eating three giant bowls of ice cream. So, <laughs> this is not going to end well. Um, so, Bart comes from the past. After talking to some guy, be like, you can only fit one. Do you, like, you know that you can't come. It only fits one. And then it's like, comes in, it's like, blah, 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 and then super epic cuteness with him and Beast Boy. I was like, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I shipped them so hard. <laughs> um, and then I, I, I loved, like, I, I figured out that I felt very stupid, because I only figured out, like, halfway through the episode that um, Impulse was there to save the Flash, from dying, um, like, halfway through it, I was like, wait. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, no! <laughs> uh. So yeah, that was my... <laughs> I'm a strange little person. Uh, I really liked the episode, um, I, especially the ending. Um, I felt it was very um, Wolverine the X-Men-ish, in that they tried to save the future, and they didn't. Um, they, I mean, well, unlike Wolverine X-Men, where they completely changed it. So for those of you who haven't watched the um, series, the basic plot is um, Professor Xavier falls into a coma, and then he contacts Wolverine from the future. Um, however, logically, it does not work very well. So if, if you could contact him at any point in time, why can't you just tell Wolverine everything the first time? <laughs> like, it just... I, I, I found that annoying. But it's, it's a superhero show. Logic does not work for it. But, um... Basically, they're trying to stop a future where the genitals... I can't remember what they're called. I just said, I just said genitals with an S. I don't know what's wrong with me. Um, Giant-ass robots that like to kill mutants. I don't... I, I'm blanking out on their names. Um they take over the world, and Xavier's trying to stop it by telling um, Wolverine and the other X-Men uh, to, like, where to go, how to do, like, anything he learns. Um, and in the end, they um, stop it. And <laughs> uh, he's like, like, oh, no. like, And he's like, oh, yes, you stopped it, but now it's, like, even worse because Apocalypse um, has taken over, and with him, he has... Um, Professor Doom, I think, and a one-eyed Cyclops. So it's like, yay, we saved the world! Oh, shit. Uh, that was very much what happened, considering that Impulse came back, believing that if he stopped Neutron and saved the Flash, the world 
would change, but it didn't because the Flash can't do shit. <laughs> I'm kidding. The Flash can run a lot. He can vibrate through solid stuff. Oh, also, um, I think this happened. I don't know. My mind's being fucked right now, but I'm... Did it happen? Am I just being stupid? When he escaped, didn't Impulse, like... No, whatever. I'm being stupid. Uh, I should probably end this because I'm being... I don't know what's wrong with um, subscribe. I might possibly, hopefully, be posting actual stuff now. Um, I do Young Justice and core reviews, and sometimes random vlogs, possibly. Avengers shirt! Avengers, assemble! God damn it, these guys are so lazy. It's like they're fucking can't move. It's like, <sighs> this is gonna get so many dislikes. <laughs> I'm insane. Like, fuck this.